Hey guys, what is up? It's Ryan, and we're here for another commentary today. And uh, I'm really excited because this gameplay in the background is the first real Moab I've ever gotten in Modern Warfare 3. Um, I have gotten one other one before, which was like, I don't know, like, almost a year ago, I think. Uh, probably not quite a year, maybe like nine or ten months ago. And, um, <laughs> it was kind of just me camping in a building with, you know, FMG9 and Kimbo's and an ACR, you know. Just all this noob stuff you do when you first get the game. But, I kind of steered away from those, those horrible ways. And I was just playing some Dota 2 yesterday, and I was getting kind of angry, because, you know, every game I played, there would be just someone picking the overpowered heroes, and I was just getting really annoyed after having that, like, three games in a row. So, uh, I had about, like, half an hour of time, so I'm like, mm, I'll just play some Modern Warfare 3. So, I uh, just jumped on Modern Warfare 3. I tried a few lobbies I tried using the KSG for about two games and I was just getting completely owned no matter just how hard I tried I was just doing horrible and just uh, suck so much I was about to quit and then I'm like mm, this next map is Bakara I'm just gonna try out an assault rifle just see how I do so uh, we're playing on Bakara I have the scar L I can't really remember what letter it is after it in Modern Warfare because it's just so different in like every game. But we're using that with uh, focus proficiency I believe with the silencer attachment and with the MP9 extended mags in my uh, as my secondary weapon with bouncing Betty and portable UAV and my strike package well kill streak thing is a specialist oh and my perks that i'm starting off with are scavenger hardline and stalker uh, i think they're all pro um and then for my kill streaks i have specialist which is sleight of hand after one kill assassin pro after two kills and then uh sit rep after five kills and then specialist bonus after seven and then you know get all the perks and proficiencies and stuff so the start of this game goes kind of slowly because there actually aren't that many people in the server uh, there was some uh, pretty bad lag at the start of this game actually everyone it said everyone had three bars but eh, everyone was kind of jumping around and everything and you would probably see in this replay that kind of you know might it's like I'll shoot and there's like no one I'm shooting at and then it'll, and then it'll be like oh you got to kill so yeah, there was some lag, so this is just what the server saw. You know, it obviously looked different on my screen because, you know, there was lag compensation and that sort of thing. So yeah, this is also playing on Team Deathmatch of all the game modes. I got my first real Moab on Team Deathmatch. But, um... Oh, what the heck? Stupid friends messaging me on Steam. I'm not sure if you guys can see that, but he's just been stupid. But, <laughs> Um, yeah, I don't think he realizes I'm recording, but, oh well, I've kind of been getting into an argument with him at school over which is better, League of Legends or Dota 2, and, uh, you know, he plays League of Legends, I play Dota 2, so, you know, but yeah, see, right here, <laughs> this was kind of weird, how, uh, you know, I wasn't really aiming at those guys, and then, you know, I was killing them and stuff, I think it's rough, yeah, <laughs> you see that kill there, just, it's crazy, man. But, yeah, snipers are super annoying, I, you know, you're just trying to play the game and then, you know, there's people just running around quick scoping and everything and, ugh, it sucks so much, I hate it. You know, you're just trying to just play the game, how it's supposed to be played, you know, but no, people just want to ruin your experience. So, yeah, I think it's around here that the action starts to pick up a bit. I feel that this game I was playing aggressive enough to get enough kills. But I was also playing kind of defensively enough that I wasn't getting killed. Uh, you need to kind of, to get kind of on some good kill streaks, you need to draw that line. Because if you camp in one spot, you don't get many kills because not many people come to you. 
And if you do stay in there, then people know where you are and they'll obviously come and try and kill you. But if you're running around without thinking carefully about where you're running and the situations you're getting yourself into, then, you know, you're obviously going to get shot. So I think that in this gameplay, I did quite good at kind of keeping the, you know, balance between playing aggressively and defensively. I was kind of sticking towards the outsides of the map and kind of just uh you know not really going into the middle but it's roughly around this point that i start heading towards the middle ish section of the map it's not really the direct middle but it is kind of the middle and i just go on a complete rampage here i was super super lucky that one of my teammates uh he called in a uav and i actually don't think like without that uav i don't think i would have actually gotten the moab so i'm super pleased about that and I don't know why, you know, it looks like I'm spinning around so much. My sensitivity isn't even that high, but pff, I don't know. But yeah, it's around this point here that I was, you know, my heart's beating so much. I'm like shaking and oh, I'm just getting so excited and oh, I was just focusing so hard. But it was also actually quite funny because at the start of this, um... At the start of this game, I was actually just watching a video, just kind of listening to the commentary in the background while I'm just playing my game. And then halfway through, I'm like, oh wait, I'm on a kill streak. So I quickly tab out, tab back in, uh, you know, tab out, pause the video, tab back in. So here we go. So it's around this, yeah, it's, yeah, it's here that I just go on a complete rampage and just kill like a ton of people. I'm kind of just, you know, using the map to my advantage, you know, sticking out corners, shooting people, you know, using that uh, sleight of hand to just reload quickly and just pop out at the right times and just catch people unawares. Uh, I really, really like using Stalker Pro on assault rifles. Just that extra speed when kind of going around corners when you uh, aim down sight, it's just so handy. And, you know, there's a campy, uh, camping sniper. I just hate them. Just, oh. Oh, campers and snipers, I just, oh, I hate them so much, but, yeah, oh, right here, my mouse actually, like, got stuck against the, like, side case of my computer, so I had to quickly, like, pick it up and move it, and I was, like, getting worried, like, oh, I'm gonna die here, so, yeah, I was really worried at that point, but, yeah, I don't know what I'm doing, I don't even know why I'm going down here, it's obvious on the UAV that no one's there, but as you can see, I'm running out of ammo on my scar, but, uh, we just pop around this corner. Stupid idiots in their final stand. And there is the Moab. At this point, I am so excited that I'm just, I don't know what to do. I'm not paying attention to anything, so I, I, I get shot. But, here it is. The Moab. I was just so happy. So, you know, thanks heaps for watching, guys, and uh, see you next time.